Hi guys, Coach Scott here, Coach Haley. Um, BTC Breakdown, Technique Tuesday. We're gonna talk about using the inside low kick to break your partner's base, and then we're gonna go over some attacks that you can use once you have broken down that base. So now here's the problem with the inside low kick. If I do nothing with my feet when I throw this kick, I'm standing right in line for Haley's right hand. If I just lazy here, she's gonna fire that right hand down the line. There's nothing really taking my head off line. So, option number one, when I throw this kick, I'm stepping my rear leg offline. And I can do that by either walking out or switching my feet. Now, if I have an opponent who's being um, particularly aggressive or heavy on that lead leg, I might have an opportunity to completely break down my opponent's posture or sort of get her to change levels. Put up here. I can throw this kick and actually can, can completely break her base. This is good because it'll stop her forward momentum and it gives me the opportunity to set up like a, a plethora of attacks off of this kick. Now, every once in a while, you'll get such a good breakdown of your opponent's posture. It's almost like kicking a, a leg off a chair, like that chair is gonna tumble. So every once in a while, you'll be able to get your opponent to really, really go down on their hands and knees. If um, you want to transition this into a grappling scenario, we have a ton of different options available, whether you want to uh, attack a front headlock, attack some sort of a choke, move to the back, or sort of initiate um, some sort of grappling scenario. Keep in mind that if her hands go all the way down, you gotta be careful with the knees because she's considered a damned opponent. Good, obviously from here, I have lots of options. I can go to the back, I can start to attack the front headlock. I just prefer to immediately attack the neck. I'm gonna come under. I'm gonna use my forearm to sort of lift her up before I even take my outside grip. From here, I turn her onto the cage and I go for my sort of Marcelo, Gar Marcelo Garcia high elbow guillotine. I come up and I hip in, all right? This is a fantastic choke, but if it's not enough, I'm really gonna drop my rear elbow and I'm just gonna force my hand in, all right? Sort of like John Jones did to Leota Machida. And I'm gonna force my hips in and raise up and get the tap. All right, so this is a really good Muay Thai technique with some grappling technique and that's how we put it all together in MMA.